All right. Well, today on the National Real Estate Cafe, we're going to talk about something controversial, and I think it's kind of fun. I like it. I know what side of the fence you're on. Uh, I'm on. Let's see what side of the fence you're on. So we welcome you to send us any emails you want to Don and Gino at gmail.com. It's uh, you can get there by going to donandgino.com, and you can find the email address on the website so that you could reach out to us and I don't know, tell me your opinion about what you think here. We're going to talk about housing affordability. So let's take a look at this uh, report here. So what it talks about here is it talks about the two camps that people are in. It talks about the people that say the homes are only overvalued. They can't go any higher and the largest cities have been overvalued. Everything's unsustainable and it's going to have to crash or you have the camp that I'm in, and the camp that I'm in tells me that demographics, young people continue to want to buy houses. It's still the American dream. Old people that are still in their houses are living longer and staying in their houses longer than they ever have. Therefore, we have a shortage of homes. And if you have a shortage of homes, there is nothing more important than supply and demand to continue to drive prices up. Additionally, it continues to be one of the best investments you've ever seen so when we talk about affordability we talk to here at skyline home loans we talk to somewhere around i'm going to say oh approximately three thousand families a year if not more and i'm not hearing them complain about payment yet that tells me that affordability is still there they're struggling with down payment a little they're struggling with savings a little that may mean that there's a general unaffordability in the economy, but not house payment. They're not complaining about the house payment. Most people that come in here can afford the house payment that they want. They just need to find a way to get the down payment. So if you ask me why I'm on that side of the fence, is because our clients are not telling me anything different. They're telling me they're doing well at their jobs. They're telling me they're comfortable in their jobs. They're projecting they're going to get raises and they're willing to buy a home and live the American dream. So if you want to live the American dream, reach out to us. Go to donandgino.com. Send us a text message. Send us an email. Send up a flare. Do something. Please, we'd love to hear from you at donandgino at gmail.com.